Yo, today we're going to talk about acetyl L-carnitine or Alcar. All right, guys, just a brief summary for you. The acetyl L-carnitine is actually just L-carnitine, but an acylated form. And what that means is it's, it's just a chemical difference so that it makes it easier to absorb in the body. It's actually just an amino acid that we can use to uh, improve basically feelings of mental fatigue and physical fatigue. There's a lot of uh, improvements for fatigue in that way. There's some evidence to suggest that it actually has antioxidant benefits as well. And uh, one thing that people note with acetyl-L-carnitine, at least for some symptoms of ADHD, is that it can actually help relieve some of the, 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 the focus and attentiveness problems that people have. In fact, one study of uh, people with ADHD age 6 to 13 showed about 20 to 65 percent reduction in ADHD symptoms. So it's actually a pretty powerful tool for people who might be struggling with, with their focus or their attention. But let's get more into that in the benefits and side effects section. So one of the main benefits of using acetyl-L-carnitine is obviously for mitochondrial support. And if you remember back to high school biology class, the mitochondria are small energy factories that are in each of our cells. And by providing the mitochondria with support, it helps us with uh, longevity, it helps with aging, and it helps with energy metabolism so that we can provide more ATP or energy and use that both in the brain and the body. Um, and that's one of the reasons why Alcar is so useful for uh, improving feelings of mental or physical fatigue. Now, uh, there's also the ADHD benefits, which I mentioned previously, where the, the supplement can reduce symptoms of ADHD uh, by up to 20 to 65 percent in, in children who are age 6 to 13. So it has a lot of effects for people who are uh, both struggling with ADHD, but also just healthy adults who want to focus better. Uh, another benefit is serotonin improvements in certain parts of the brain, such as the hippocampus. One study showed that uh, serotonin in the hippocampus could be increased by around 22% in the people who were evaluated based on that study. So uh, that's a lot of the benefits. And really, when it comes to side effects, there aren't a lot of problems in, in most cases. It's rare, but some people struggle with gastrointestinal problems. Uh, usually, Acetyl-L-carnitine is either taken in capsule or pill form, and if you get the, 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 uh, the powder, rather, then you might have some gastrointestinal problems as well that are a little bit different. But one of our recommended vendors is actually Nootropics Depot, which uh, has acetyl-L-carnitine powder, and the dosage is around 600 to 2,000 milligrams a day. And if you have uh, the ability to, to weigh it out on a, a milligram scale, you can use this powder. If you don't, then you can buy the capsules as well. But if you're interested in the acetyl carnitine from Nootropics Depot, you can check out the link above. And keep in mind, we've actually vetted Nootropics Depot as one of our recommended vendors. And we have seen their, their HPLC and all their examinations that they do in order to make sure that their products are safe. So again, check it out at the top and I'll see you guys next time.